Hi everybody, this is Jim, and I wanted to make a quick video to share four recent CD acquisitions that I got from the Goodwill store on the cheap, as usual. All these CDs either cost 99 cents or as much as 2.99. Most of them were 99 cents, but these are all what I would consider essential jazz albums. And I'll get right into it and share uh, what I like about these albums. And hopefully you can find some of these albums uh, in your own local thrift stores and charity shops. We're going to start with Ella Fitzgerald. This is the Irving Berlin Songbook, Volume 1. And uh, this was on Verve Records label. It was released in 1986, and you've got some classic tracks on here. Let's Face the Music and Dance, uh, Russian Lullaby, Alexander's Ragtime Band, How About Me, How Deep is the Ocean, All By Myself, 16 tracks in all. It was arranged by conductor Paul Weston. And it's a it's a great package. Irving Berlin, classic songwriter, and Ella Fitzgerald. Well, it doesn't get much better than Ella, does it? I found another Ella Fitzgerald album, the Cole Porter Songbook. This was volume two. I believe I already have volume one. All of these songbook albums by Ella are worth hunting down for sure. This is also on the Verb label. This is the uh, remastered version. And uh, I actually think I like this one even better than the Irving Berlin songbook album. Uh, she just does killer versions of uh, Cole Porter. And I think what she's great at doing in her styling is bringing out the uh, the nuances of Cole's lyrics and uh, she, she just delivers it so clearly that you can you can focus very much on the song lyrics and th that's what I think Cole Porter is all about so some of the famous songs on here are it's the lovely love for sale night and day I've got you under my skin you do something to me and it just was a it's just enjoyable from start to finish. Uh, the, the tracks on this songbook album were arranged by Buddy Bregman, played by the Buddy Bregman Orchestra, produced by Norman Grants, and uh, really a wonderful, wonderful album. Next is the best of Blood Bud Pal, The Blue Note Years. This one, I think I found... For, it cost me two ninety nine. Some of the charity shops are uh, upping their CD prices, which is uh, I, don't, I guess I wouldn't say it's concerning, but I'd rather pay ninety nine cents because um, I don't know if it's a sign that CDs are coming more into demand or not. But still, two ninety nine is a great price to get some classic jazz like Bud Powell. Uh, so it's on the Blue Note label. Uh, just wonderful, wonderful versions of songs on here. It's a great compilation. Songs like the 52nd Street theme, Bouncing with Bud, Glass Enclosure, Blue Pearl, uh, Parisian Thoroughfare, and uh, what a brilliant pianist Bud Powell was. So if you don't have much Bud Powell, uh, this is a probably a really good starting point. All the sessions were recorded in mono, uh, and this is a compilation, so we're going from different phases of his career. And then we have Charlie Parker, Bird. This is Bird's Best Bop on the Verve label. Uh, this came out in 1995 on CD. It's in the bop style, of course. And although the sound quality on this, you can, you know, you're, we're going back in time here. These sessions were recorded uh, 
at different, like the from the late 40s through the early 50s. So you hear, uh, you know, lots of tape hiss, and it's it's not like audiophile quality. But what they did with this uh, CD, which was mastered by Steve Fallon, uh, it's really present, wonderful sounding kind of in-your-face music where the musicians are like right there in the room with you and so, so many of my favorite jazz albums like you produce that effect and um, it's totally worth uh, seeking this one out it's a it's a great compilation you've got songs like Passport, Bloom Dido, Leapfrog, Relaxing with Lee KC Blues, Blues for Alice, Swedish Schnapps, The Song Is You, Laird Baird, and on and on. 16 tracks in all, and um, produced by Norman Grants. And uh, you know in your good, you are in good hands uh, with that. So these are four jazz albums just picked up in the last month, and they are... Um, just superb superb they're going to bring a lot of joy to you and uh i hope you uh share in the comments to the video uh, some of your recent jazz finds and maybe comments on some of these albums and what your favorites are and if you have recommendations for other people in the uh, cd and audiophile community share them in the comments uh, if you like the video, please click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and um, sign up for notifications as well. Thanks for watching.